If you wanted to feel better about your Rocket League gameplay by watching our pros looking like average Joes, then you clicked on the right video. What's up guys, welcome to another video. We're rolling with this month's sponsor, AOEAH.com. For cheap Rocket League items, make sure to check them out, the link is in the description down below. Use the promo code TVG for 6% off. This will help you to get the items you want without paying full price. Now if you've got a lot of items just laying around in your inventory, check out their website. Your items could be worth a lot more than you think. This is a legit site guys, so go and check them out. Don't forget to use the promo code TVG for 6% off. I'm Jess for Top Viral Gaming and before we get into it, I have some very exciting news for you guys. Starting next month, we are giving away 15,000 Rocket Credits. We'll be announcing the full details here on August 4th, but if you want to know sooner, head over to our Instagram page and follow us there. It's at Top Viral Gaming. Make sure you're subscribed here as well because you don't want to miss this. 15,000 credits will be given away. And now let's dive into today's video. Ever since Epic got involved in Rocket League, the biggest complaint by players seems to be the changes made to the ranking system, where it's now harder to advance in the rankings. But regardless if you're bronze or grand champion, blunders and mishaps happen across the board. And sometimes, uh, I mean, they're kind of funny. In today's video, we're doing a little bit of a highlight compilation where we look at some pretty legendary pros making some pretty big fails. This is when pros look like pure noobs. Okay, so how many times have you landed flat on your hood when attempting a backflip? The backflip is an essential, and it's a move that many pro players pull off like a reflex. At this point, it's just second nature, but the room for error with this could be massive, as we see in our first clip. Off the backboard, but now it's up to Jacob. A demo by Gimmick. Jacob puts that shot close, but just wide. And a miss there from Sizz. This ball's just going to roll right into the net. Cloud9 get the first goal of game number three. Just trying to see what ended up happening there. He's on back on the defense. And as he comes across, he just flips a little too early. A mechanical mistake. Not something we see too often. Sizz could have easily blocked that ball, but since he completely botched it, he was left in the dust and, well, you saw the end result. Squishy ends up with one of his easier goals. Let's stick with another backflip fail. Vafale clears the ball on a flick and it seems like Cronovi is able to just send it back to the other end, but something really odd happens. Let's take a look. I'm on this. You see Waffle set this one up off the wall. Best shot Cronovi. I've seen all day. <laughs> Cronovi, though, he, he, he realizes he's in a bad spot. He's like, oh, wait, up, oh, and he touches it. And then he's like, wait, wait, no. And he touches it again. And it, what the, I, we're, I, I'm embarrassed that we called this the best team in America right now. What was that? <laughs> Cronovi does get a touch on the ball, a bad touch. And the ball ends up in his own net. What makes this one particularly odd is how he continues to move backwards until the ball ends up in his own net. Okay, let's keep going with the flips. In this next one, Flitz decides that he needs to show off some more acrobatic and super fast flips. And how does it work out for them? <laughs> well, let's just see the clip, okay? Roll it! Off the ceiling, not the best shot, but it's caused a little bit of problems. Team bump, actually. And almost an own goal! It is an own goal! Flitz needs to look where he's going when he's rotating out. He's dodged straight on top of Faded. And then he's dodged a second time straight on top of the ball. What is he doing? Flits. After bro fisting his teammate, he backflips and flicks the ball towards his own net. And what's worse, he tries to chase it and make another aimless backflip. I mean, that has to sting. How many of you have made some of these mistakes while doing a backflip? If you have, hit that like button to let us know. This way you'll see that you're totally not alone. There's a lot more fails coming up, but what's the worst that's happened to you? Let us know in the comments down below. Now for this next flip, you don't need to be a pro to understand how an early boost can cause a pretty obvious gap. Let's take a look. Baby, but, but snack, Yep, when you completely miss a boost shot and you crash into a wall or flip aimlessly behind a ball that you've missed, 
you will look like a complete noob. Now let's talk about open goals and how missing one can be the most embarrassing thing on the pitch. The worst open goal misses could be when you're just in the best position and the best angle looking at an unguarded goal and then you miss just by an entire mile or something. These are rare, but in all of the years we've been playing this game, we have definitely seen moments where players just panic and do the exact opposite of the simplest shot into the goal. And yes, it happens to the best of us. Sorry, Squishy. Ay, ay, ay. No one saw anything. So as you just saw, he had a clear goal wide open in front of him, but our boy decided to get too excited over here and just try to rush things. It looks like he forgot that the point is to put the ball into the net and not the car. <laughs> and how about that recovery of trying to play cool by driving off like nothing ever happened? Now if you thought that one was bad, wait till you drive under the ball. Yeah, yikes. Let's see the clip now. Yeah, uh, Travius mobbed me. Oh, was? Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Tor! Nein! <laughs> wow. I mean, just wow. Sometimes these highlights just leave me speechless. How does that even happen? Do you know what's not as embarrassing as missing an open target? Hitting a post. This does instill some rage in pros, especially when they feel like it's constantly happening in a match. For these moments, we designated that player as the post magnet. Take this one, for example. Got it, boys. Wait a minute! Whoa! Alright, hold on. I mean, put any player in that position a hundred times and they should still score 99 of them at least. But here, Rizzo decides to be that one and just drives the ball straight into the post. I mean, it happens to the best of us friends. Now, the closer you are, the easier it is to score. Especially if the goal is wide open, right? Well, let's just see if that's always the case. I just had a little boost, and there it is! The boost makes this one even funnier because <laughs> the ball literally flies as far away as it can from anywhere near the net or the car. Now, in this next clip, just like any other player, Flytrix rushes to the opportunity of an open goal wide open in front of him, and he reaches that in time, makes contact with the ball, only to see the ball hit the underside of the crossbar. And, well, watch and see what happens. No way! <laughs> you hit it double times and it Did you see that? Okay, let's see it again. No way! That's right. The ball dropped back on his head like an apple. What else can a man do after this apart from crawl up the goal? That's rough. Before we go on, we want to thank you guys for checking out this video. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and click or tap that bell to get notified about our latest videos. Also hit that like button, this lets us know that you want to see more content just like this. Now pros usually have great control over their vehicles, to an extent that's unbelievable at times. But sometimes when things get too fast, any human is bound to make a mistake. Too much speed will result in a lot of errors. But it will also reduce the amount of times they can be seen on the replay. When you lose control over your car, you are bound to make all sorts of embarrassing mistakes. Like crashing into walls, players, and sometimes even your own goalpost. About this player has possibly been a top 10 player in the world. We'll see if he continues to hold up and what happened here. Nobody uh, wanted to touch it. Uh, nobody wants to talk about it, and I fuse. I'm not going. So over to the side, he's back in the middle, and this was, oh, it was Timmy with the own goal here. And I'm, Dapper I'm with the back. actually <laughs> not. Nope. You can see how CLG Miko is all set up protecting the goal, but completely lost control over his card the second he stepped off his line to get into position. After that, it was like a skinny dude riding a bull as CLG flew miles off the goalpost, leaving it wide open for EG Crow. He tried to return desperately, but it was all for nothing. This is a massive new play. Let's see it one more time. I'm not going over to the side. He's back in the middle. And this was, oh, it was Timmy with the own goal here. I'm with I the back. actually <laughs> not. Nope. Now, after watching these highlights, we can all see that even the pros are human and make mistakes. What's the biggest or worst misplay you've ever seen? Let us know in the comments down below. I'm gonna get out of here, but before I do, you guys should go and check out some of our other videos. Be sure to subscribe and turn on that bell to be notified about our latest videos.
I'll catch you guys later.